I touched the couch and I said, yo, how come the leather on this couch is so powerful? I said, no wonder Kyle's using his skin. What's up, world? It's your boy, Daystorm Power, and this is my mushroom story. In the time I wrote the greatest song that never existed. Okay, so here's my mushroom story. I said, you know what? I'm gonna get some of my friends. They're gonna come over to the house and we're gonna take some shrooms. Now, what they say about mushrooms, they say that mushrooms are supposed to make you just open up your mind and do a bunch of amazing things and become more creative. And at first, I didn't feel the mushrooms. I was like, man, nothing's happening. So then we go to the window and we look out the window and then the power lines start to glow. And I said, oh man, the power lines glowing. This thing's probably starting to kick in. So then, it really was a surprise for me because I was able to laser focus on one thing instead of focusing on a lot of things like my friends. I mean, they was doing crazy things. I really knew it started to kick in because I looked at my boy Splat and he was up under the table. But I have a table with a bench. He wasn't just under the table, he was under the bench with his legs spread eagle. I'm like, why, why is his legs open like that? So that's when I knew these mushrooms must be working. I look over to the left, my friend Janina, she's in a glass box. I'm like, what is she doing in the glass box? Because I have a wine closet that's actually made of glass. And she said she was locked in. There's no locks on my wine closet. So I knew there was a problem when she was in there. I said, we must be hot. I didn't believe it to the point until I saw my friend Jade and she was dancing on the middle of the floor. And I mean, she could dance. I mean, I felt like I was watching Step Up 3D. And she said she wasn't dancing. She was actually running from a beat. So now we knew at this point we were high. So at this point, we wanted to learn. So I saw my boy Splack and he started to ask questions. And he said, yo, what is the population of Antarctica? And I said, wow, he enunciated every single syllable of Antarctica. I said, how do you even say it like that? We thought that he was the most intelligent human. We thought he had a 200 IQ when he said Antarctica. So he went over to the little globe and he looks at the globe and then he spun the globe. It landed right on Antarctica and we were shocked. Now, anybody could do that because it's right on the bottom of the globe. But at that moment, we felt like Splack was this human from another planet. So we went outside, we all go outside into the backyard and we start to look at things and we're like, wow. The sky is glowing. And then I started to think the, all of these crazy thoughts. I touched the couch and I said, yo, how come the leather on this couch is so powerful? I said, no wonder Kyle's using his skin. Started to make sense. I said, wait, if the earth is hot, why is space cold? And the sun's right there. How do you go from the earth being hot then you hit outer space and it's cold until you get to the sun? If we're made of so many small particles, why we don't just fall apart? And all of this is happening in my head, and I'm just like, oh my God, I gotta get off these shrooms. The crazy part is, four o'clock in the morning comes around, right? And we're still up. Towards the end of the high, we finally laid out in, on, on the floor like it was Lollapalooza or Woodstock or something like that, right? I said, yo, I wanna write a song to see if this creativity really works. So I wrote the dopest song ever. It was gonna go crazy platinum. I, I wrote the song down and I run to the bathroom and I'm humming a song like, these butterflies, these angels, these wings, these butterflies, these angels, these wings. And I'm like, this is crazy. I don't want to forget this, so I got to record it. So I went, I ran into the studio at the time because I was so gone, I couldn't turn on the studio equipment. So then I run to the bathroom and I say, yo, I'm going to put on my voice memo. So I go and I turn on my voice memo and I'm in my phone like, mm -mm 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 -mm. so I fall asleep sleep after I write the song. The next morning I come into the room, I'm, I'm walking in like Denzel Washington, you know how he got that walk, right? I'm like, come on, okay and all right, I got this song for you. So everybody gather around and I'm standing there like, yo, y'all ready? And then I push play. Man, that shit was trash. They just laughing at me, man. That shit's garbage, son. I said, damn, man, these shrooms got me fucked up. Tales from the... Yo, thanks for watching my mushroom story. Make sure you drop Comedy Central or subscribe and hit that bell. Ding, 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 ding. Follow me on all of my socials. I'll see you next time.